guys, welcome to my studio. So if you don't know me, my name is Felicia Fallon. I'm an artist and I do all sorts of other things, travel, culture, uh, yeah, in that sort of realm. Uh, these are a couple paintings that I have that I wanted to show you in my studio. So this first one is a commission that I'm actually taking in to the woman who bought it this evening after I get done teaching art. I wanted to show you my process where I made, I painted these three designs and then I, from which ones she liked and what she liked about them, I moved on to the final, a draft of the final design, which is like that. And then, uh, and I call these sketches. When I sketch things out with watercolor, this is kind of what it looks like. They're little paintings that I may finish later. And then sometimes I'll sell the ones I finish later. Sometimes I just keep them and sometimes I'll use the backs of them. Different things. It depends on uh, if I like them or how they're going. This is the final. So you can see how it progressed. I'll set them up next to it. I painted them in and painted the sketches in. And then you can see the final one there. I really loved the frame on it. It turned out so nicely with the color, so I, I really am excited for this painting. And then these little ones, I really, really love. Um, they're inspired by an artist I saw in Portland where he did marker work, I believe, and then he had these little tiny outlines on the outside of it. It also is possible that his was uh, graphic design and done on a computer. I'm not 100% sure, but these ones are watercolor, and then I markered around the edges of the watercolor. So a really, really fun, unique technique that's very different for me, but really, really works for my style. So I'm going to be doing more of that with the Travel Your City project. Um, and these two pieces, I have them setting out for the studio tour. I've got a bunch of in-progress ones. You can see those two as well that are very similar. Uh, the dark-skinned ones are inspired by my Sudanese friends, Thenwa and Shaima. And I just, I love their colors, I love their skin tones, everything about them I think is just gorgeous. And so I painted those ones, and I do the women at the well, or the name of the painting is at the well, and it's usually an orangish background with the bluish purple, orangish yellow background with a bluish purple uh, figure, and so then I add henna to the backgrounds of it. So I'm going to do henna on these at some point, I just haven't yet. But yeah, that's kind of what's going on in my studio today. So if you guys have questions, um, I'm also doing NaNoWriMo, so I'm doing... Updates on that. I'm writing about some stuff that we'll talk about later. Maybe. I'm not sure how much I'll share, but uh, yeah, so I make art videos usually on Tuesdays. Hey guys, I am framing a piece of artwork. It's a commission. Uh, sometimes I think I really struggle with matting and framing myself, and I do it myself even though I could pay to have it done because I think it's a more responsible way to, to it's just more responsible financially, and then I don't have to pass that on to the client and it just works well for everyone, except I hate doing it, so I take so long to do it where it's just this mess, but um, I thought it was funny because today I, I joke that I'm really good at eyeballing, I just, I'm not going to measure anything, and so I put this in the center, and it can be, the bottom can be bigger than the top, and it actually, like, it feels right, the weight, it distributes the weight properly with the frame and the mat to do that intentionally, you don't have to, but you can. But uh, I sometimes joke that my eyeballing is more accurate than my measuring, and uh, this is one of those cases where it's exactly three and a half uh, inches, and then this side is also three and a half inches. I'm off by like a millimeter, <laughs> a half of a, not a, a half of a sixteenth of an inch. I've also been told to start doing matting in centimeters, so I might give that a try. Um, not today because my eyeballing was so good, and I'm not, I'm not doing the math, I'm just going to cut it on um, based on this <laughs> measurement, but, uh, yeah, I just thought it was funny, so anyways, I, I love this painting,